And now, our feature presentation. Alrighty, boysies, how's it going? How's it going this fine, fine day? Oh, oh, I'm off a wee crash. Of course, I've had a wee update to PCX2 and it just has a wee crash every now and then, but aye, how you doing, boysies? How you doing this fine, fine day? Welcome to you live from the Dusty Old Man Home Video Store. That's right, boys, we're digging back into uh, no, it's the X-Men, it's a very different game. Uh, Resident Evil Code Veronica. And we are currently at a stage where we've made it in back to the Antarctic Fortress. We're trying to find our sister Claire, and we've not got much of a clue where we're going, apart from we've picked up a strange uh, paperweight, which hopefully will lead us to deep, much deeper into the facility. So, got a lot of stuff back here. I've got to keep the shotgun just in case things get a bit hairy. But we're going to try and use only the handgun ammo for now. Oh no, it's these boys again. Right, I'm just going to run up here for a second because I need to have a wee sort of gander about where I am. Because, see, if I play, I, if I stop playing for like a day, I'll forget where I'm going and what the whole layout is and all that shit, you know? Right, so. Just having a wee look, I have been. Where have I been? Right. Oh, two seconds. I'm just going to mute something just because that's pretty loud. Two seconds, boysies. All right, boys, there we go. We're back. That was a quick wee thing with the subway, but... Still not got much of a clue where we're going. So, let's maybe have a wee look down here because we can afford to get fucked up. I say that. We've saved in that wee room. So if we die, we can just respawn there. But unfortunately, I've got to go past the fucking... The wee moths again. Oh, no. This is much bigger than wee moths. This is... It's big boys. Oh, yeah. What the fuck is that? It's tightly sealed. Is it to kill these guys? I'm also poisoned now, so let's... Oh, no, I'm not poisoned. Shit. I probably should have used the... Ah, shit. I need to get some healing juice. Ah, yeah, bastardy. Right, he's no DJ. Wait for him to pop up, and... Is that them? Right, let's check. That. Do I need to heal? I do not. Tightly sealed. Right, I came down here for for nothing. Right, hmm. Just investigating everything, seeing if the only thing I can see Chris looking at is the blue herb, which we don't need to use, so I I don't think here was useful. Let's head back up this oh wait, wait. no, that's not, that's a lucky box, that's not a, a door. Right, where have we been and where are we going? Let's have a wee gander. So we've just came from... I think we came from in here, so maybe... Let's have a... Let's have a look through here. Right, now where are we off to? Is it anywhere we've not been anywhere that... See, I've got my eye on... Uh, I can't get there because uh, that's cut off there, so... Let's go to the left. Uh, yeah, my my left. Let's head in here. Heading in here. Still wondering about like a heedless fucking chicken. Confused where I'm going. Oh! Your boy's in here. Oh, shit, they got out! Right, you know what, let's... It might be a massive waste of it, but if I can take him down like one shot. Or not. Shit, how is he still going? Three shots of a shotgun didn't kill him. 
Fuck. I can't, it's clearly cheating. So how many shots he's taking, right? Oh my god, there's so many boysies. Right, I got the case. There's something else here. Take your shotgun shells. Yes. And let's combine and equip. Because I've got a feeling I have to go that way because that's new. Right, let's try and save the shotgun bullets. Right, just this one left here. Right, is that them? Is he getting back up? Cool. Right, I need some health juice. Health juice would be lovely right now. But at least if I die, I know where to go next. Broken and can't be used. Right, let's investigate the case. Can Chris open this? I don't think he can because it's lockpick. Give it a simple lock. I could open this if I have the lockpick. Well, we'll need to wait till we get Claire back before we do that. Hmm. Nothing useful here, nothing useful here. Right. Hmm. Let's have a wee wander about. So the botanist is flooded now. That's That was the oh, BOW test area, wasn't it? Right, we're just going to keep heading through. We're going to try down here. Come on, give us something good, come on. He is just a, a smidgen of health juice. I mean, a bit more than a smidgen would be nice, but... You know what I mean? Right, what are we, where are we now? Can I see him to interact with, or is this just a... Right, why did Claire come here? She picked, oh, she picked something up, didn't she? So... Just try to think where we could... Where I could put stuff, or what I could do. Hmm. So what have we got? We have... I might reload my save because I got really fucked up there. Like, really messed up. I know I've not got much ammo. Oh! Oh, wait, I can walk on it now because it's frozen. Right. Does that open up anywhere for me? I don't think it does exactly. What about this? Can I interact with this? I cannot. Hmm. Very, very confused right now. But then again, it's not hard to confuse me. Right. Hmm. Ah, wrong way. Right. So all I need to do is need to head and get the case. Right, where was the door that I came in? I think that was it, wasn't it? Right, what am I in line about? Like, did something maybe come off, or...? Oh! I can jump on this then. So then I can go in here. Oh, we got a cutscene, so this is probably some good. Oh, Wesker's wee drones here. What? He's here? Ah, you bastard. Thank you very much for time to react there. I'm just going to go to the back here because there's probably a hunter in there behind me. And nothing good can come from that. Nothing good can come from a fucking my hunter. Right. Besides my health right now, that thing would destroy me. A control panel for the crane to operate if I need the crane key. Right. So I need to get a key. That's the main goal here. I'm 
I'm gonna get a shotgun up. Man, things have not been in my favour today. Things have, in fact, went really badly. Oh, shit! Oh, man, I should have my bowgun bullets. The bowgun just deletes them. Is that a deed? I don't trust it, but... Right, where are we at now? This is... It's a new area. It is indeed cool. Nothing strange. Nothing strange. There's a lift there. Oh shit, I should investigate a big blue button first, shouldn't I? Unless, or maybe that was the button for the lift. I'm, I'm just going to turn around, go the other way, hope he didn't see me. Because I, I just need a wee bit of health juice. A wee couple of herbs, a wee first aid spray. That'd be, that'd be lovely. I see some shiny, what's that? That's probably the item that I can't get because your old dad forgot to pick up the fire extinguisher right at the start of the game. Right, what's in here? There's a small square hole. As I notice, you can drain the water fall under the following conditions. Clean the tank to exchange the water. Right, so I think I probably need to get a valve thing. I should not let the water out of the water tank. I mean, that's where the water lives, after all. Hmm, right, so... I guess I've got nowhere else to go apart from down here. Oh, shit. I had to pick up here. Lots of chemicals here. I wonder what purposes they're used for. Is that not a boxer? Ah, it's not. No, it's just not him down. Ah, you bastard. I thought I could run by him. It's tightly shut. Oh, this is where I'd use the fire extinguisher. If I had one, but unfortunately, your old dad forgot to pick it up. He's not, he's getting back up. Ah. Oh, I'm knowing a good way. Nothing useful here, nothing here. You know what? I'm just going to throw myself into the fire and then we'll restart. From a better... Or maybe I can't die from it. Cool, I don't think I can die from the fire. Because we're in a shockingly bad situation right now. Let's head out to where we fought the hunter. Oh shit, that's, I need to dodge that again. Oh shit, there's another one. Right, uh. Shit. Just run. Well, there we go. Just got taken out. Cool, right, so. See everything I done last time? Let's not do any of that this time. So. I'm going to drop the... This in here. I'm going to take... I'll take the bowgun with me. I'll take the bowgun. I'll leave the shotgun. I'm going to get the... Where's the... Got a lot of bowgun arrows. Holy shit. But uh, do I have any of the mad like, explosive ones? Grenade rounds. I don't think I do. Should I take the shot? The ah, fuck! I'll take grenade rounds and take a launcher with me, and hopefully that'll be enough to do in uh, doing the hunters. I've got any herbs? I've got a red herb. I've got a red herb, a blue herb. Cool, right? So I've not got much boysies. There's line about here that I've maybe forgotten to pick up. Right, that was where Nosferatu was hiding out. But clearly got out. So. I'm 
and I'm just going to... What do we pick up there? We'll come back to that when we need to. Because I've got a feeling that everyone's along this way. Right, let's head back. Head back here, maybe? Right. Head up this way this time. What's in here? I can't quite remember. Right. Oh. So I can jump up there. Wait, let's jump down here. See if that opens up anywhere. Anything that I can pick up or interact with? Can interact with this? Nope. Can interact with this? Nope. But I can go in here. Those guys are going to wake up, aren't they? After I pick up the valve, the octa valve handle. Let's just get out of here because, my god, I'm not good at... Not good at the... What you got? Tank controls? Right, here we go. So I've got a... Oh! Oh, no, it's something in the water. What is it? Oh, it's more zombies. Let's just run away from this. This is a fight I don't have to take. Oh, shit. There is a lot of them. Wait, right, let's just run up here. Oh, shit. Ah. Right, uh, back this way. I don't know if it's back that way. I just panicked and ran. Oh, would you look at that? We raid from Thong Man. So how did it go? How did the rest of your Dark Souls randomizer go? Last time I think I seen you were in... Oh, what's it called? What's it called? The... The place you fight... Uh, not Smallfoot. I forgot his name. Uh, big... Dr scaleless... Dr see the Scaleless, that's it. He absolutely fucked it. Aha. Kieran's crying. I'm gonna kick Kieran's stupid little fucking... Oh, Jesus. Uh, look, I'm bouncing his head till it turns into a fucking trifle. That bad? What was it? What? How was he bullying you, son? I mean, don't get me wrong. He's a monster, and he deserves it. He deserves it. But what they? What they do? I was hoping the grade launcher. We got through the crystal caves. Ooh, nice. So you got through in the nightmare section. Next day I came out to the wee hollow shop in the sewer and fire link. Oh, the one where she sells you the fucking... What is it she sells you? Like... That's where you get the curse thing, isn't it? Yeah. What's the fucking second making slow progress and a fucking heavy attack? And jumped off the bridge. Oh, that's a, that's a bad gen. These are things that I'd, I'd, I'd be howling at stream, on stream if I'd done them to, like, I'd be like, ah, Michael fucked up, ah, how the fuck could you do that? And I would do something a thousand times worse, you know, I've just accidentally unequipped my fucking shit, ah! Kieran said yes, man, about eight times. That's okay, just remember, he's fucked up a thousand times more than that. Back at it tomorrow, yes, man. It does look like the most fun possible, but also the worst time ever. It looks so good. Like, you've got me reinstalling Dark Souls 1. Not just not to play randomizer, just to dig back into the game, because I realise now there's so much, like, so much shit I had no clue about. Like, see when you whipped out the wee fucking... What the fuck is that? I just clicked, there's a fucking... Is that on the roof? Or is that under the ice? Very fun, boss makes me want to kneecap Kieran and uh, make me make him eat his kneecaps. I can get a word out, Jesus Christ. I mean, I have that urge every now and then as well, you know. 
Mickey, do you know your channel points have point is gone or what? What do you mean the Ah shit? I'm just gonna turn away because there's a fucking hunter coming in behind us. The do you mean the King of the Ring thing? Ah, it's finished. You can't redeem channel point stuff. What? Not all of it. That's weird. I've not touched any of it. I mean, Michael can redeem my body pillow. Kieran's. Jesus Christ. Top three Jason lies. <laughs> uh, we'll go with the fact that he's actually cheating his elbow speed runs. I've seen them. There's cuts in there. Is he dead? I'm, I'm, I don't want to take a step forward in case he hops up. Hey Ross, how you doing, pal? Right, okay, maybe the hunters aren't as bad as I thought, because I just counted him once with a grade, and that was him deed. But if I head up here... So we died here last time. There's a small square hole. Oh, square hole. I've got a fucking... Yeah, a fucking... What's it called? Octa thing? Octagon. I right, can't use it there. Cool. Hmm. I think further down, because we, we got fucked up here when we went down there and there was nothing there apart from, I think, was there even shotgun ammo? There's a switch. Push the switch. Yes. What the fuck is that? It's an extinguish shant. If you're um, half considered playing new Black Ops, because I've heard it's shite and I want a shite shooter to play. The thing is, I think Call of Duty's good for like if you're not saying that brain dead shooters, but it's like if you just want something to sort of relax that you don't have to pay all of your attention to, you know? It should be used by a fire extinguisher. Well, I forgot my fire extinguisher right back on the first fucking island of the game, so I were a bit fucked. I think this path is completely closed off. Yeah, multiplayer is always like fun to an extent, you know? I've not played the new one. I've not played one since Cold War, and Cold War was that bad that I just dropped it. I still played Cold War a shit ton because I was in college and I was sitting on like team meetings, you know. And I, I, I want something that I don't have to pay much attention to, but so I could still play while being a bit brain dead, you know. Cold campaigns like McDonald's cheeseburger never gonna be good, but they're always reliably all right. Uh, I don't know some of them more than others. Like, Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2019, which is a really annoying title. What was that audio? Ah! Someone's run towards me, Big Fish Boy's run towards me, I think. But the Call of Duty oh, Black Ops Cold War campaign was really not good. Play a lot of Modern Warfare and Black Ops 1, multiplayer is a danger. Can't really do multiplayer these days. Too old. All these wains in there. Oh shit. Oh, there's a lot of boysies here. Uh, do I take this fight or do I probably just run? Yeah. They take so many shots. Right, is it just you that's left? Oh, Herbie's. Ah! Too much anxiety over shite and ruining our people's drink. Fuck it. Fuck everyone else's enjoyment. Aye. Yeah, bastard. Right, so there's that many zombies. It's really giving give me interest about what's at the end of this hall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hide down. Oh, fuck. Your pal there is getting back up. Right, let's shoot him down and let's get a grenade launcher out. I know I said I was going to save these for bosses. Yeah, exactly. exactly. People do not do not really care about your... It's the thing is, it's not even like a team... Like You'll be in teams for games, but... It's not Overwatch where 
for example, in Overwatch, you're part of a team, so you need to play as, you know, like, you need to do your part, you need to uh, do a healer, do a tank, do damage, whatever. While in Call of Duty, like Kieran says, every cunt's just looking at camos, every cunt's looking at fucking... You know, no cunt is paying attention to you. You could be the worst player possible and they'll still just be doing something. It hasn't been used in quite a long time. It's locked. This should open if the power were to be... Sub I've done all that. Just be told that the fucking power is off. Shite. It's fucking daft, but I go PvP and my heart going to palpitation mode. Depends on the mode, and depends on the game. Or for me at least anyway. I've never been much of an online gamer guy, apart from Overwatch, and... Used to be big into the MMOs when I was younger, but not so much anymore. Admittedly, that is the thing that I've heard a lot about the movement sure, the movement in that game is going, Oh look, it's got XYZ in movement now, you know? Right, what's this? It's an electricity connecting device. There's a hollow in the shape of an octagon. Oh, would you look at that? And guess what we've got? Oh, oh, it's in. Yes, man. And then... It's an electricity connecting device. I can uh, switch the supply of electric power. Right, let's move the lever. And there we go, boys. Let there be light and let there be plenty of herbs. Yes, man. Even when I was playing League, I'd never play with at least two pals on my team because I couldn't deal with toxic randos. Oh. I'm saying, so I was sitting playing. I was not in a great headspace last night. I was like a bit sort of down, a bit sort of, you know. And I was like, I'll play some Overwatch. And literally, my biggest mistake was saying, let's play some Overwatch because fuck me. The. Like, I just, it, it, don't know, it's not nearly as bad as it used to be with the community, but fuck me, oh, it's bad. I used to, I'm so used to old movement that I keep diving backwards c consistently, or all the time. And I, I like a Call of Duty when Call of Duty got, it's a bit fast paced, always. Because when I think of like slower games, I think of, uh, oh, what was that one? What was that shooter? It was, I think it, is it, not Arma? Not, fuck, what's it called? What was the one that was called Operation Red River or some shit like that? That wasn't armor, was it? It was... I'll put the case back in here. And we'll do a wee save, because we've made a nice wee bit of progress. Shotgun shells. Plenty of shotgun shells. Operation Flashpoint, that's it. That's what I'm thinking of. Like, you know, but... Yeah, a lot slower, while the Call of Duty was, like, very sort of fast-paced and shit, you know? Closer to, like, your boomer shooter sort of speed, which that's the kind of shit I want in... Yeah, bounce pick up Haley. GG's everyone. Oh, no problem, Kieran. Take care of yourself. See you around. Right, uh, do we save first? Now, it's okay, boys. Even if uh, we fuck up continuously for the next 90 minutes of the stream, we have made a bit of progress. Not much, but a bit of progress. Right, what have I got in my... I'll put the ink ribbon back, just in case I pick more stuff up. Right, ink ribbon goes... Where's the rest? There we go. Right. So it was headlong here when the power was on. Wonder what gun it is I missed out on. Because I've also missed out on the assault rifle. I've missed out on the submachine guns. Oh. Wait a second. I know this room. This is the art gallery from Resident Evil 1. This is kind of cool. Look boys, I should be honest. This is possibly the... This is like the most I've ever, like, take the jewel. Yeah, fuck it, take both of them. Got the blue jewel. Oh, I mean the red jewel's away. 
seems to work by take a socket. That's you have a tiger. Joel's missing. Put a Joel back. I'll take a blue Joel. And I'll take the red Joel. It was the blue one that I taken. Take the Joel. Right there we go. What are these? Magnum bullets? Oh yes, man. Can't wait to get a Magnum and just fucking delete boysies. Oh, is this always like stockpile when I get Magnum shots? Because they're very rare to stockpile them. Even when I get to the final boss, I never use them. Oh, I've been washed down, I think. Wait, where was that? The transport terminal. Oh, boys, I don't like this. Not one bit. Fuck me, standard edition of Black Ops 6 is 70 for on the PC Xbox store. Jesus. I know that, uh, take the wing object. Sure, why not? And fuck these bugs. I'm just running. I've got a feeling there's going to be a boss fight coming up soon. Yep. Seems like it. Wait, I've noticed that uh, full price games have went up to like 70 quid. It's mental. Like, I, like, I remember when... I think it was when the PS5 sort of generation came in. Because I got Megan Horizon. And that was like 70 quid. But it seems to only be like the first party big releases that are that much. Because Metaphor was like 55 quid, which... I can't believe I'm saying our oh, game was only 55 quid, you know? Well, games, like, I'm, I'm not pretending that see when games were like, so PS2 and shit like that, and even 360, was 40 quid no, like, brand new price? Virus research report. Work continues on a T Veronica virus, which I had extracted from a queen ant. The more research I conducted on it, the more I, I was impressed with how much potential it has. I finally implanted the virus into my own body and discovered how to utilize its power. I will avoid making the mistake that I made with my father. I will suppress the activity of the virus at an ultra low temperature so that my cells will change slowly. My calculations are take it will take 15 years before my body will gain immunity and become able to coexist with the virus. Oh. Wasn't that before, was it? That's weird. Oh my god, you're kidding me on. Has the whole stream looked like this? Well, too late to go back and change it now. Because it, it crashed and it was set up fine before. Right, so she was experimenting herself and it was taking 15 years for it to... Let's hope that none of that comes up in a puzzle. It's fine. It's fine. As twins, Alexia and I are two sides of a coin. The design is carved under the name of Alexia. Right, and to write that down, so that's heart, club, a... King. There's a button with a like push the button. Uh R Clop A Crown. There's no response. Wait a second, the two sides of the same coin, so reversed maybe. So crown a crown No fuck I put Crown, a spade, heart. No response. Maybe I've mixed them up. So it's a crown, a spade. Hmm. Okay. Well, that's a. Uh... I'm confused, boys. He's right. So 
Two sides of a coin. Design his card in the name of Alexia. Uh, maybe I need to look at the. Let's have a look. Let's have a think. Right. So. Is there an order to this then? So it's. Maybe if I go. Crown, a spade heart. Oh, no, it's, so it's two sides of the coin, so maybe if it goes that way, so if I start with crown, heart, spade A, maybe. So that's crown, spade, heart, A, maybe? Nope. Hmm. I'm very, very confused. Right, uh... Let's have another look here. So... Alfred and Alexei are two sides of the same coin. Right, so... I'm looking at a guide here and it says... Look at the paperweight, rotate it clockwise to see the correct order to put the buttons in. So clockwise is that way maybe, so king, heart, spade, A. I think I've, I think I've tried that, but king, king, heart, spade, A. Let's try that. So king, heart, Spade A. No response. Shit. Hmm. Right, I'm just gonna Google Resident Evil Code Veronica Coin Puzzle. Right, so, like what it says about the coin, the two sides, if they say, if they say face, tails, face, you put tails, face, tails. Oh, so I see what's the opposite of it. Cool, so it's, uh, right. right, let's get notepad written out again. So I'll look at what's on the opposite side of it. So it's. Heart, bed, A, A, and brown. Cool, so let's have a look. So on, we're on the, what's the opposite side of the heart? Heart is the A, A. Then it's the spade, which is the crown. Then on the AA, it is a heart. And then on the side of the crown is spade. Right, I've got you, I think. Right, so I push the AA button, I push the crown, I push the love heart, and I push the spade. It appears I should put something in here. Right. What do I put in there? What do I maybe put in? Hmm. So, 
Hey Monica, how you doing pal? How's your day going? Wing object. There's no need to use it now. May I put the paperweight in? Oh, something's happened. Oh, it's Alfred's body. How can we be sure he's dead? I see some shiny. Take Alfred's ring. Yep. And now I'm gonna check this. It appears the jewel can, portion can be removed. Take the jewel. Yes. I've got Alfred's jewel. Right, hmm. So maybe I put them in the tiger thing? It's Big Owl's jewel. So have you recovered from the, the anger stage, Michael, or are you still seething? I hate this bit, I hate it. I hate them. What's on our side here then? Shit, I really should have just stopped. I should have stopped pick up the herb, but I was too busy just running. Right, we can get it the next time. Oh, zombies. Shit. Oh, a lot of zombies. Right, let's... Right, let's pick up this herb and... Let's get ready to run. Right, where's the safe room again? We'll head back, gather items, and save. Right, where's... let's have a wee gander. Where's the safe room from here? So I think maybe I have to use that on the tiger thing, but we're just going to go back and save, just in case. Can I push it up to this? I seemingly can't. A woman drawing water. And the safe room was in there, wasn't it, I? Right, let's chuck away all the stuff we don't need. Like the magnum ammo. Chuck that up here. The socket. Put that there. Put the other green herb there. Put the wing object. In there as well. And whereabouts is the ink ribbon? There we go. And I think we're going to head back to that bit with all the zombies, I think. Right, cool. Again, we've made a bit of progress. Happy with that. Let's head back through here. Go ahead a bit deeper in. It's locked. The bio has symbols carved in the keyhole. There's something there. No, that's just a wee plant. I think I need to keep that. Uh, I've got, I've still got Owl's big jewel. I do, but I think I need to keep that because I seem to remember there was a note saying something that need a jewel from everyone. So I think that's maybe important. Right, 
there's gonna be bugs everywhere, so I'm gonna run. I'm gonna, I'm gonna run to the right. I hate those bugs so much. The thing is, I don't think they're even damaging me much because I'm still in okay, I think. Go check my health quickly. Yeah, so it's just annoying. Oh shit. Oh my god, there's so many zombies here. Uh, if I was smart, would have came in here with a weapon. Well, I've got my handgun, but you know what I mean. I guess just shoot fire away. Oh my god. It's an awful situation. Because these cunts just aren't dying. There's more ammo here. Right, and then just combine, reload, and just get blasting. Right, we're good. Oh, wait, no, he's getting up. He's getting up again. Right, let's just finish him off, make sure he's no getting up. And there's a zombie out there, isn't there? A computer time must be hooked up to a supercomputer. Right. Is that him? Um, what have we got here, apart from a research report on Queen Anne? After discovering remains of ancient virus within the genes of Queen Anne, I have concentrated the research of ants. Uh, ba 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 ba. Some bit ants being really. My God, so much art, so much. Uh, not art, so much fucking writing about Queen Ants and shit like that. Right, is there anything here? Some alcohol still left inside. Right, an alcohol lamp. Okay, right, I uh, don't think there's much. So, I think all that was of note was in here was the handgun ammo, I think. So, we probably, Queen Ant is dead. The Ant Hill seems to have been perished. What about this one? Right, cool, so there wasn't anything else to, to see or do in here. Oh fuck, I'm still in caution. Right, so it was a waste coming back here. So, I'm not quite sure where to go now. Right, let's try taking out the right jewel and we'll use Alfred's jewel. See if that maybe does anything. No, don't do it. No, fuck. I don't think I can. I think I can only... Right, take that. Right, I'm going to leave this because I accidentally fucking... Right, and we're going to use... No need to use it now. Right, cool, so that's my other idea out the window. Well. So, I don't know if there's anywhere to go here, apart from maybe go back the way. Right, let's do it. Let's have a wee bit of I'm not, I'm not going to save because all I've done was get fucked up and lose ammo. I didn't pick up anything important. So if I die... Let's have a look. What have we got? Socket. Oh! Oh! I've just had a thought. It appears to be a, some kind of socket. Can I combine those two? I can. And what's this? 
It has a square shaped protection. Oh! And then once I reload, I think I can actually go and use that to drain the water. Now, if I can just remember where that is, which I can because your dad's got dementia. Right, oh yeah, I shot myself here because something's run, to run towards us. Fuck it, let's go see what we're dealing with. Fuck me, hot. Right, okay, one of those poison hunters. Cool. Right, I'm gonna reload my save. Because hopefully I'll be in better health then. I'm gonna take the shotgun out. How much ammo have I got? Yeah, shit, we're in as good of a situation as we were before, so... Yeah, I guess we can just run down there if we're really desperate for our ammo. Let's get... Grenade launcher. And... Grenade launcher and... Ba -ba 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 -ba. Grenade rounds, there we go. And just slap these in here. And just get ready for the fucking... Which got Hunter that's gotta come get us. Right, I hear him. I hear him. Let's just get a good shot on him. Damn. Oh, God, nope. Oh, fuck. Ah, we're poisoned, but it's okay, because... There we go. Sorted. Your old dad's got it sorted. Right. I can't quite reach what's in there. What have we got over here? Is it a carousel? Oh, another wing. Now I can grab whatever this is. Another... Wait, we've got three wings now? Can I jump on there? I cannot. Wait, what's in the double doors here? Oh, I recognise this place. This place looks familiar. I mean, it's not exact, but... It's Claire. She's fainted inside a cocoon. I need some kind of tool to open it. Right, let's go get a tool, whatever. Maybe if I head back. Oh, shit, it's locked. Oh, wait, no, I came this way, didn't I? Right, so I'm going to head back this way. Oh, wait, I come. Oh, yeah, I'm going that way. I was going to say I'll go back and do that, but I don't think we've, we've done enough to justify save, going back and saving again. I'm just trying to go back in my brain to figure out where about I'm going. Right, I think it's... Oh, yeah, bastard. Right, just dodge that. Is it in here? Maybe? I think it may be all the way back. Because I think it's a bit where I was like, oh, we can't go... Is it here? It is here. Wait, no, no, I may, may go up. Fuck. It's down there that's useless for me. Right, get Chris a wee bit dizzy. And... Pop up here. And there was a valve somewhere, wasn't there? Yeah, square hollow. Alright, ah, I keep getting stuck in this. Wait. 
Oh, fuck, I done that last time before the hunter murdered me. Fuck. So I should have went back to the safe room. Your old dad's fucked it. Fucked it, boys. I was all confident. I was all, oh, I've made good progress and shit like that. Let's not go this way. Let's can I shoot these things down, maybe. It's okay, I got past it. Went in the safe rooms, let's go just through the next door and into the the left. Right, here we go boys, here we go, here we go. Now now I've got you. Now I know what I'm doing. I didn't really before, but I've got you now. So I'm gonna drop off the the wings. Let's go. Where's where's the other wings? Where are they? And I'm getting the octa thing and the. If I was a socket, there we go. I was gonna say where would I be? Right there. Right then, we're just gonna head up. Again, we're making okay progress. I'm not gonna lie and say it's amazing progress, but we're making progress nonetheless, you know. So I figure we might not finish this today, probably not today, and maybe not even next time, but the time after, definitely. Because this one does feel a bit longer than the other Resident Evil games. Oh, I don't know how I avoided that. I should I should have got caught by that, but ooh, right. And I need to figure out where I'm going next in the Resident Evil timeline because I don't know if I I'm definitely going for a side story somewhere. Feels like a lot of running about. Bear in mind, there's probably about half of it. There's that probably half of running about because I was very very lost or doing what I'd done there and just forgetting things, you know. Right, and then drain the water, and what's in the water? Hopefully a tool to get clear. Right, what's this? What's this? It's a crane key, right, and then I can head back to the main bit. Oh, yeah, bastard, you! It's alright. Those things can they use uh, ladders. It's a well-known fact. Oh, Jesus. Don't poison me, please. I'm poisoned! Don't be poisoned, don't be poisoned. Fuck! And it's a long road to get the, the blue hair that I've got in the safe room. You know what? Let's... Oh, fuck, let's just use the crane key here. Just gotta rush through and try and do the fucking. Oh! Who done this? Who's that? Oh, it's uh, Nosferatu. <laughs> Alexia. That is how I dispose of insignificant bugs, said the spider to the fly. How do you wish to die? <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry, Jason. There's a giant fucking spider. Sorry, Shinra. I'm poisoned, I don't have any healing items. Fuck. Ah, you bastard, you. I freaked out uh, when I first saw the, the shadow of it. First time I played it. It's a big boy. 
Right, there we go. We got, we got the jewel. Taking Alexander's piece. Ah, ah, where do I go now? And then jump up here, maybe. No, thank you. Right. There was a safe room down here, wasn't there? I probably best just going for that. First of all, I'm just going to do this wee bit. See, it's probably better going the other way, but I panicked and just ran this way. Where's the safe room? I think it's just down the stairs here and then right across. I don't know if it's just safe because I'm going just really out of the way. Get down there, Chris. Now I've clicked, I need to deal with that thing when I go back there. Right, here we go, here we go. Wait, Shimmer, you don't like spiders too either? Uh, too, do you? Too either, what the fuck, Mikey? Right, I should use up the red one, shouldn't I? Because that'll definitely get me up to... Ah, yeah, bastard. I thought, I, I thought that'd be enough. Right, boys. Uh, so... So I need to do a run over to the mansion area now. So, uh, look away, boys. What's that up in the sky? What's that? Oh. Oh, I don't know what that is. But it's gone, whatever it is. I don't mind spiders. I think, I think it's because... I still love the arachnophobia mode in Soul Company because it replaces spider model with bright red text that just says spider. Hilarious idea. I just don't... I'm not scared of spiders. Like, I think because we used to get, like, in our in our old tenement, we used to get, like, woodlouse. We used to get all these horrible bugs, you know? And spiders were the ones that kept away the horrible stuff, you know? Like, don't don't go on it. I'll chuck one out the window if it's like getting a bit close. But see if it's up in the corner, I'll just leave it. It's fine, yeah. No hurting anyone. Right, where am I off to now? So, oh wait, West goes. We scanny things are gone. I'll get rid of them if they bother me. But the wee pal, aye. You keep all the flies, you keep all the other shit you don't want in the house out. Like, there's other insects, if I see them, I will fucking flip out, you know? I love moss, but if those wee bastards flutter in the flat, chewing up our fabrics, they're getting squished. I, I never squish bugs. The only, time, the only time I've done that in the last maybe couple of years was we had a lot of, you know those wee tiny flies? We wee tiny, tiny ones, I think they're fruit flies are called. They're... We had a lot of them because we had our lights on and it was really dark outside. So they all came in the flat. So I just went, right, shut the windies, shut the fucking doors. I'm going to squish all these boysies. It's, you know what I hate you know, when you're sleeping? And there's a, there's a moss came in, but it's the big moth, and you can hear the fluttering, you can hear the sounds. Oh, I hate it. I've killed so many bugs that come from stuff, so they call me a war hero. Yes, man. Right, where am I going now? So, I've, will I do a save? Yeah, fuck it, I've made it that far. Oh, God, I need to sneeze. Two seconds, boysies. It's coming, it's coming. Don't edge me. Don't edge me again, body. Ah, you bastard. My body's fucking edging me on the sneeze. Right. Where to now? So, along at the... Whereabouts is the mansion again? That's where Claire was. So, it's down here and then... Down where the fucking hunter attacked me.
Right, here we go. Here we go, boozies. Right, let's explore here a little bit. A picture of a twins and their father. Three weird holes open. And they're the boy's finger. The man's ear and the girl's bosom. So maybe if I... Put that one in. Picture of twins and a father. Ba 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 ba. I put this one in. Right there, we've cleared up some inventory space and put some new jewels in there. Wait, what's this? What have I got? A knife. Can I maybe. I still need to use a tool to. Is this maybe enough? Right, let's just turn the corner here and. Oh shit, that is a tool enough. I was there, was me looking for some industrial strength sort of cutter thingy, but no, we've saved Claire. Claire. Bloodline saved. Chris. I mean, it's. Thank you so much. I know. Remember that meme? I was great. I have to get out of here. Not yet. We have to find Steve. Oh, do we? Who's Steve? He's a boy who escaped from that island with me, but then a monster attacked us and we got separated. He's just a wee boy. He's still somewhere in this base. I'm sure of it. Claire? What's wrong? I think... I think I've been poisoned. Ah, oh, for fuck. Just hold on. I'll be right back. Right. How the fuck did I unpoison Claire? I think I was in the fight with, uh, what you call it? Nosferatu. I must have just ran through it. So the guide says... Head back to the room where you found the magnum, which is the room under the fire extinguisher room. Head back, uh, then handle. Head towards the camp. Oh, I know where I know where we are. Oh, I'm gonna have to use so much ammo because there's so many zombies in there. Ah, wrong way again. Right, so I think it's through here. It's down where we thought, oh, I'm going to have to deal with the giant spider and the hunter as well. Fuck. I guess that's what I get for running away from everything. Let's go get some uh, weapons and ammo first. So we can heal Claire. Put the knife back because I don't know when I'm ever gonna use a knife again. And grenade rounds. And just equip this. Oh, because I forgot to take a blue herb in, to, in with me to Nosferatu fight. Which I imagine you can completely skip this segment. But now nah, you're all that fucked up. I wonder what weapon Claire has on her. She's got the machine, like, handgun thing. See if I can rescue Claire by the end of the stream, I'll be happy. Actually, no, I don't need to deal with a giant spider at all, because that's in there. There'll be a hunter through here, I think. No see me yet. Is that a deed? Yes, man. Right, so I think it's down here. So I'll have a wee gander about because if I find a magnum, that I could come in handy. Oh, fuck me, there's a lot of zombies here. Ah! Right, 
find a corner so I can line them up and and then did I get him? Wait, what's this? What have we got? Take the serum. I imagine the magnum's in there if I extinguish that. God damn it, boys. He's got, yeah, bastard, you caught me as I was running out as well. Right, so he's definitely not getting back up. Right, at least it's a straight line back that I can't fuck. Oh, I was going to say, I can't fuck it up. I fucked up saying fuck up. Jesus Christ, that's a badge in Mikey. Right, here we go, here we go. Why, right, boys, I've now, I've now realised I need to... Uh, I need to actually play fucking Crash Team Racing tomorrow. Dear Jesus, I'm going to claw my fucking eyes out. I'm going to be playing that about 11 o'clock in the morning. So a bit of an earlier stream is that, uh, as opposed to I've been doing a bit sort of late night stream, so... Ah, you'll be able to get your Crash Team Racing fix tomorrow. I'm fucking dreading it. I'm, got, I'm hopefully going to try and finish it tomorrow. Right, Claire. Give Claire the serum. I'll take care of you now. Feeling better? Can't wake up. Wait, can't wait to wake up and immediately see you lose your mind. Her, huh? You're always looking out for your little sister. <laughs> it's Alexia. Alexia? There really is an Alexia? <laughs> oh, there she is. It is almost time, you genetically inferior siblings. <laughs> After her. She might know where Steve is. Let's go. She might know where Steve is. <laughs> oh, fuck. What is that? That's like tentacle. He's halfway through the game, but it doesn't matter if the last boss is hard as fuck if you're Mikey. Well, my goal is to try and finish around one o'clock because that's when Crash comes on. I don't like to go a bit. I don't like to overlap too much. But we'll see. If I'm on like the last race and the, it's coming up for like two hours, I'll just keep going. Chris. Oh no! Chris's wee legs sore and just go. some screaming. I'll be fine. But Chris, you've got to save Steve. Go. Do you give myself two hours to beat the harder half of the game? Well, I'll give myself two hours if I've got, like, still a lot of stuff to do. Because I don't want to go, like, right, boys, here we go, starting a stream and it, we're on the final boss, you know? Unless it's, like, a, you know, a role-playing game. When the final boss is three hours long, yeah? Right, here we go, let's do some item management. Oh, oh, oh. There's a case in here, isn't there? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Yes, man. I can open this up, check. What's in the case? Fucking Magnum. I've not got a Magnum. So I do need to heal up. Right, let's... Uh, hopefully the game just gives me a magnum in the later half. Is this a save room as well, or is it just a storage room? Can I push this over? What could these hooks be used for? Hmm. Oh, the shotgun. Oh wait, hang on, this is game. Where's the, with the infamous fire extinguisher? Yeah, I fucked it. Oh, grenade launchers. Oh wait, Chris has got that fuck. Here's a secret way to get a Magnum, but also to win a race in Papa's Pyramid. I can get to fuck then. 
Right, we'll worry about them later on. See, I'd never heard of the infamous fire extinguisher thing. Otherwise, I would have kept a hold of it. Because, like I said, that'd be a Magnum I'd be having right now. And I don't know if you know, boys, but Magnum is actually quite good in video games. Right, let's heal up first. Uh, what we'll do is we'll mix. Right, we're in the fine situation now. What I'll do is I'll take a shotgun. Because I'll save the grenade launcher to Chris and Claire can have the shotgun. Right, here we go, boys. But lads, everyone look away. Nobody look at the screen right now. What's going on here? I don't know. I don't know what that is. It's a Dark Souls Resident Evil game. The thing is, it's also solid and there's a lot of enemies. It's Also, I just find it so weird because every other Resident Evil game has the, you know, easy, medium, hard thing. Every Everyone. Apart from this one. Fucking shat myself. Locked my side. Okay, maybe just... Well, it's a case of, like, why would you... I know, I get the idea of maybe having, like, a tra... I'm not saying that, like, having a trap exactly like that, but I get the idea of having something that was kind of similar. But, I think so, but why would you think, oh, I better keep the fire extinguisher now it says empty fire extinguisher? I mean, I know it doesn't say throw item away, you know? Like, mo most items do that. Right, uh, emergency activation, evacuation elevator, only work in an emergency. I wonder where we need to go at the end of the game. See, I've just talked myself into it. Hmm. The fuck is that down there? Security risk for the linear launcher. Lock is automatically released in an emergency. Oh, I need to turn, I need to open up, so I need to turn both things simultaneously. Locked, there's a hollow in the shape of a dragonfly. Oh, and I've got three of the wings. Right, uh, let's hop up here. What's a cannon? What is that? What's this? Security file. The Astro family's m most important secret is kept at this lab. As a safety precaution, I have installed a self-destruct device in the control room. I have placed the activation code inside the computer. Once inputted, all the doors lo and door locks will be released in order to provide easy access to escape routes. By using the elevator that directly connects to the hangar, one should be, easy e should be able to escape from the lab easily. Please remember, I have used the name of my beautiful ancestor in the activation code. Glory to the Ashfords, Alexander Ashford. That's the password you go on about all the time. There's a handle, turn the handle, yes. The what? The Lenny Dick Slip. He wants to eat his son. What the fuck is this? I've got a crystal. What's in the crystal? A well polished crystal. It contains a card inside. I could see if I could. Uh... Oh god, sorry. Coffin fit just hit me there. He's squatting down, screaming his head off. Trying to split arson. What the fuck is going on? Right, there's a dropping thing there, so maybe if I use. There's no need to use it now. Never mind. I was confused. Well. Somehow knew the game was gonna do bullshit like that to me. Right, uh, combine.
I'm very confused. So I'm guessing the puzzle has something to do with that bit. Lenny Kravitz squatting down and screwing his face off with his full cock and balls hanging out. So Jesus Christ, lads. So was he just doing like a big, a big scream in a song, after he's squatting down and hit a high note and his trousers came asunder? What's this? A card reader? Oh, I need to get a card from the card reader. I see, I got you. I figured it out. See, I'm a genius, boysies. Right, so get the password. It's password Veronica. I get it. You want to shag your fucking gran. Cool. Turn the handle. Right, what the fuck do I do here? Right, uh... Maybe place it here. But maybe run into the middle and use shit. Oh, you're kidding me! I'm, I'm fucking shaking myself, boysies. I just gotta run right into. Right, I'm standing in the mid in the middle. Right, I use that. Cool. Get a security card and oh, it's turned off. I see. I can go in here and get just ammo. What's in the ammo? Bowgun arrows. More bowgun arrows. I think I've literally got in the hundreds and hope it falls again. Why would you be so cruel, Jason? Oh shit. Just shoot him to knock him over. We don't have to kill him. There's a card reader through here, I think. Hmm. Use a security card. There we go. This is very ornate. Oh shit, it's Steve. And he's got a giant axe. Steve? Steve? Oh. Claire. No, I can't do it. Who did this to you? That crazy woman told me. She was going to perform the same experiment on me that she did on her own father. She's completely insane. Oh, no. Not our boy Steve. What's wrong? The world's too cruel. So I've heard this bit is particularly bullshit. Oh no, he's turned into Shrek. But he's still got his hair. Ah, <laughs> fucking look at him. And then Steve was the zombies. So I remember uh, I watched a video by the Sphere Hunter, who she does a lot of Resident Evil videos, and she said this bit is absolute bullshit. He'll give the tyrant fight too much shit. Because if he hits you twice, you're dead. Yep. 
Jesus Christ. Right. Well, I knew to do all that without dying. Right. So I'm then I'm gonna I'm gonna you get an other excuse me. Gonna get an other uh what's got where's the Oh shit, is that all my herbs? Time runs out and Roy Steve gets you instead of tigers. Oh, it's okay, there we go. We got an, we got another red herb. Right, let's do all this again. I'm gonna I'm gonna make a safe state right outside the bit with Steve. Because Jesus Christ that bit's a bit of nonsense. Because literally two hits and your full health is just gone. I'm sure you guys have mentioned this before, but who was the murder boy in Fort Boyard? Was it Dirty Den? Because I've seen very little Fort Boyard apart from what Jason showed me. Fort Boyard was around the time of when we're watching a bit, like we're watching TV and shit during lockdown. We watched a lot of catchphrase, and that's how we found Interceptor. And I think Fort Boyard was in there as well. It was dirty then. I have to do this arsehole of a puzzle again. See, Code Veronica has got a lot of good ideas, but it's also got a lot of shite in it. Right, let's pop that in here. Well, I think it's. Do, do I prefer this or Resident Evil 3? I don't know. I think Resident Evil. I think I just prefer Resident Evil 3 more than this. So I think right now it's at the bottom of the all the Resident Evil games I've played on stream. I think. Oh well, no, I forgot about uh, which call it? Operation Raccoon City. But that's not a real Resident Evil game. It's a spin-off made by another company. I think this one needs a remake more than four did, because honestly, I could still play four and have a great time. You know. Well, this has a lot of. Uh, a lot of uh, issues that, you know, could have been ironed out in a remake. But I don't think that's a hot take. I think that's quite a tepid take, from my, by my standards at least. Right, here we go. We get to see this lovely scene with Steve again. Oh, so still a bit raging 4 got a remake and this didn't. I think, but 4's still really, like, the remake's really, really good of 4. But 4's also, the game's still, like, like I said, really, really fucking good, and you can buy it on PS4. But actually, actually, I'll have a good one. So at least they've done a HD remake of this, right? Or not, well, not remake, HD remaster. Which you cannot buy on the PS5, because the PS5 version is the PS2 version. Why not just put on the, you know... crazy woman told me she was going to perform the same experiment on me that she did on I'm her own. I'm trying to what Resident Evil games She's got leaked. I know Resident Evil insane. didn't work us out. Resident Evil 9 has been supposedly worked on. Then I don't know if there's other remakes getting worked on. But see if they skip fucking Code Veronica and go straight to 5. It's going to be very confusing. I mean, you could maybe remake one. I mean, well, they've done two, three, but, but two, I imagine, no, I imagine they've done three because it uses a lot of the same shit that two does. How fucking dare you, Jason? I like, I like Resident Evil 5. It's not perfect at all, but I like it. I want them to get weird and go, right, boys, we're remaking Dead Aim or we're remaking fucking gun survivor, you know? Or we're remaking Operation Raccoon City. Oh, what, what a time, boys. Or Outbreak on a better scale. Not that Outbreak isn't good, but right. Boys, look away. What's that up in the sky? Is that a rare hummingbird? Shit. Shit. 
Jesus Christ, Steve. The wheels I break now would be one of the, those games Nakump plays. Oh shit! I fucked it. Tank controls have done me in. Oh shit, made it out, but I, I might redo that, because I... Yeah, fuck it, I'm gonna redo that. Because I absolutely fucked it. I figure I can get through this without losing. I can fucking get through this without being in danger. There we go. Probably didn't need to use that set. Well, no, I would have healed anyway. There we go. Big Steve's fucking raging. Claire, I'd maybe walk away through the cage door. Oh shit, maybe that would happen. Maybe it would be uh, some failed live service shit like a Metal Gear one. I like survive. Oh, I guess it would. Actually, I know Capcom. Of course it would. Oh no, we're about to get murdered. Oh no, murdered. Murderized. Oh, but his pure heart has stopped it. With the power of love, he's overcame the infection. Oh no! The tentacles have smacked him back. Oh, Steve. oh he's transformed back. Oh, he's in it. Is he in the scud? Heaven's gained an angel. Our Steve. Reptile, real one. Brothers come to save us. We're getting out of here. You are. When the front is meant to be a big, <laughs> excuse me, Brother, big co-op PV live service, warp mode survival crafting game. I'm sorry, I cannot. Oh yeah, it was like let's save the earth. It was called or some that. I'm glad that I met you. I. I love you. They should, they should just, every game, interest a new love interest for Claire, just it's killed off every single time. Oh, Sean's greeting Steve? somewhere. Steve? Steve? <laughs> Alright, Peter, tell you one. Pour one out for Steve. I think the thing with Fortnite is it's it's got all the licenses, it's got all the fucking, you know, big franchises. So it's like jangling your keys in front of a way and going, Oh look! Wolverine, look! The Resident Evil characters are in it, you know? Oh yes man, here we go. Come with me. This the bit was used in like every AMV. And now the only existing sample is in your body. I want it. Now. You want it? You are not worthy of its power. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here's Alexia's final form. Well, no, no, it's a lie. It's not our final form. It's just another form. Mad Parasite Eve form. And there we go. She's now a big plant creature thing. 
Wesker's got her stuff, eh? So this is the stuff they add in Code Veronica X. They added in like an extended scene here, I think. You're coming with me. The individual Dreamcaster gets it. Look at that. Yes, man. What a guy. He done like a springboard fire punch thing. Oh, what a guy. Got some noodles to have for dinner. There's been utterly obliterated. Oh, here we go. Oh, but Wesco's been distracted. She's looking very anime with that sort of fringe. Since you're one of my best men, I'll let you handle this. Right, Wesco just fucking legged it. But we've not been able to leg it. Oh fuck. So wait. I didn't even get a second to prepare for that. Did I get her? Well, final boss deed, that's it boys. We done it. I mean, that, that music was cool. Uh, Alright, there we go. Thank fuck I had to, I, I carried the fucking grade launcher ammo on me. I would have been fucked if that was the case. The game expects you to do the bit with Steve where you die in two hits and that without doing a save point in between. Oh, that's mental. Right, hmm. So I wonder if we'll have to worry about Alexia again. Probably not. Wait with two seconds to get a can and the boss looks already done. I just happen to have like a grenade launch ammo. And just blasted it right in the face. Though it is a good tune, like our music there. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, it's pretty good. Oh, Alexia's getting back up. It's also the fact that my. You're kidding me on, there's zombies down here. Right, hmm. Let's get a hang on it. It's also the fact that, like, uh, my grade launcher it, it fires out so many shots that, like, you know, in a sort of arc, it just deleted her because she was that close to me. Right, what's the shiny? Code Veronica report. After many long years of research, I finally identified the inherent element that administers the intelligence of man. I even succeeded in manipulating the absolute value of intelligence artificially by re recom posing the base alignment of the element. I then sampled the gene of our great ancestor, manipulated its element and implanted it, the unfertilized egg into a surrogate mother. What I didn't expect was twins, a boy and a girl. They were born, the boy had higher intelligence than normal, but not high enough for him to be considered a genius. However, the girl had unmatched intelligence that easily allowed her to be classified as a genius. She was exactly what I had been looking for, the revival of our great ancestor. I already determined their names the girl's name Alexia and the boy's named Alfred. I am certain that Alexia will elevate the name of the Ashford family to extreme glory. Alexander Ashford. Oh, his kids are clones, I see. Hey, I'm gonna pop down there because I've got a bad feeling about that door. Right, what's down here? What have we got? Right, some shiny in there. Can't open this with my hands. What what's in there? A button if I push a button, why no? Take the wing object Oh now we've got another one. I see some ammo there. Right, I'm gonna pop up here. Oh, herbs. You know what, boys? I think I'm going to just try and... I'm, I'm gonna probably going to go straight into the next... Maybe not straight away. I think I'm going to... But I'm definitely going to make it more of an effort to try and finish more Resident Evil games. 
Because I ha I've had said on stream that I want to try and finish all of them. Oh shit, right, let's back off a bit. Just this one. And I've got quite a few to get through. Especially when we get to the PS2, holy shit, there's a lot of... Uh, there's a lot of spin-offs around that time. A lot from our side. I'm going to have to deal with all these ones, aren't I? Wait, is there anything to pick up here? There certainly isn't he. What I might do is I might do like a vote about what Resident Evil game I dig, in, uh, dig into next because I put that up in the chat last time. And it was between Gaiden, Code Veronica, or Survivor. And Gaiden won. I mentioned it before, but the video I occasionally fall asleep to it covers an entire series like seven hours long. Is it Avalanche Reviews? Because he does pretty good like survival horror videos. I think he's done like all of the franchise. Noah Cadwell Jerk. Gervais? Ricky Gervais? Gervais? Gervais, that's it. I think that's how you say it. Couldn't fucking say a name, holy shit. Right, what else have we got in here? Oh, first aid spray. Gervais. Portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of the Ashford family, Veronica. I think she's alright. Yeah, let's do a B save. He does full franchise overviews. A lot of different series. Sometimes I just look at a single game, sometimes I compare two games. And sometimes they'll do travelogues. If it is a long as hell and the only thing I can fall asleep to. I find myself falling asleep to like, you know, sort of long ones as well. Like, there's a really good one by Magellar who does like, uh... He's a guy on the VH VHS horror one, but he does one about the whole Kingsfield series. And I'll be honest, I've watched that video, I want to say, about five or six times. And I've only made it to Kingsfield... Like, Kingsfield 2 once. Because I keep real and I keep re listening to the bit about Kingsfield 1. Right, hmm. Wait a second. There's a few cool travelogues where he goes to road trips to visit locations like the Fallout so you see how well they were translated to the games. Ooh, that sounds kind of cool. Wait, wait. I w how do I get to... Hmm. So, I'm just having to think where to go next. Actually, there's a door around here. I've not checked this door. What have we got in here? Don't see anything. The music box lid is closed. A blue sapphire has been removed. There are gorgeous furnishings here. Nothing useful here. Oh, I can go through here. Ah. Wait, their bedrooms are exactly the same. Holy shit! Stop the music box. Music box locked, the red ruby has been removed. Cool, so I need to play both of them. I've unlocked the door. Right. 
I'm confused. Right, so I came out of... I was looking at the wrong bit there. What's in here again? Is this the... That's the sort of computer room, isn't it? Where I got... Right, so I'm now looking for the sterile room key. Oh, actually, I've not checked up here. Unlocked the door. This suggests that I've been here before. There's something in the corner there. I'm no feeling it, but there's something in the corner. Wait, the sterile room's here, isn't it? Claire? Is that you, Claire? Oh, no, Claire's in a cage. No. The door won't open. Hey, is Steve with you? Despite all her rage, Claire's just a rat in a cage. Steve, <laughs> Poor Steve. He was too pure for this world. Listen, Claire. We have to get out of here immediately. Can you unlock it from the inside? No, I can't. Chris, there should be a self-destruct system somewhere. If you activate it, all the electronic locks might be deactivated. You've taken the security file. Wait. There's no need to use it now. Wait a second, right, so... Let's have a wee look again. Right, that red flashing bit's the bit with Claire. Cool, right. So I have looked at the guide, and it says right here... Make sure to save because this will be our last chance for the final boss. Holy fuck. Right, so where was the bit with all of the... Oh, yeah, bastard, Jay. Where was the bit with the... Uh... Ba, 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 ba. So it's now returned to the safe room. Turn off the power. What safe room? The one... Uh, return to the mansion, so leave the mansion. Right, there is something there, but I'm not finding out what it is. Right, and where was the power? Where am I going now? Where am I going? Because I'm just back here again, aren't I? Right, so... I go in... I came from this way, didn't I? Right, I'm back here again. Right, and return to the safe room, it says. Oh, he's a sterile room key. Oh, this is a sterile room. Cool. Right, and something's flashing here. I've taken the blue jewel. Oh. Right, cool. So. And yeah, cut the power somehow? How do I do that again? How do I do that? Where, oh, where was the. Oh, 
I remember. Never mind. It was in the the safe. If I like the guy said, it was in the safe room. No, I think I've taken the wrong turn again. Have I? Ah, fuck, I've not taken a wrong turn. I need to go through here. And then to the right, I believe. Or, yeah, to Chris's right. Right, never mind the loading screens. I'm up. Your old dad's getting a bit confused. It's hard, it's, you know, easy to do in his old age. Right, so... I think it's this way. I've just got... They're, they're ants, aren't they? Because if they've done the experiment on her and shit like that, she's the queen ant, isn't she? He's already dead. Wrong room. I think I need to head around the other way then. See, I'm... I get really bad at remembering the layouts of places like this. I just can't do it. Right, oh, right. right, let's run through the ants here, and I think it's, it's that way. Wrong button. So I don't think that's where I'm going. I take another turn, right? So if I head back to the mansion. It's annoying because I know where I need to go, but I can't figure out, remember the path there. Right, run up this way maybe. Right, I think I, I think I see it there. I think that's where I get the power. Yeah, the power is. I just run up this way and through here. Right and. Right, let's do a little bit managing here, so put the ink ribbon back. Well, even though we're gonna use the ink ribbon. I don't know if it'll be the last time I get to use inventory and shit like that, but I'll do a save anyway. Because we have done quite a lot and I know what I have to do from here, I think, at least. Right, and let's go Chris, uh, Chris 39, here we go. Right, and then let's pop this back because I'm going to need some inventory space. And where's the, where's the rest of the, your wee boys at? Right, and yeah, turn the power off, which the power room is in the fucking safe room. Right, I think we're good, I think we're good. We're on the home stretch, boysies. Right, turn the power off there. And how do I get back to... Locked. 
fuck. Oh, there's another door I can use to get there, isn't there? It's gonna take a long way round. Right, and then in through here. And then I should be able to go get the the gems at a tiger's eye. Where was that again? Where was where was the tiger bit? Oh, it was over here. Over here, I think. Right, and jump down here. It is pitch black. Holy shit! Right, I can take that jewel. I can take that jewel. Right, now I need to head up to the bedrooms, which I found. Where were they again? Where were they? Oh, if only I found these before. Right. Let's, uh, where, where are we going? Where are we going? Hmm. Through here, maybe? Ah, yeah, bastard you. Did his head pop off, or was that just... Whereabouts? I'm just going to map. I don't... Ah, you yeah, bastard. I thought I could get by without him grabbing me. And I think it's through here. And use the red gem. Is a music box click take it? Yeah, sure, why not? And then maybe if I use this in Alfred's room. Right, and then use the blue thing here. And music box plate, use that. Right, and I head up into the scary room. Oh gosh, give me the fear. Oh god, what's got what's got be at the top of here? Oh, I don't like the camera watching me like that. Just give me, give me the heebie-jeebies. Take a dragonfly object. Handgun ammo. I'll be happy to take that. And herbs. Let's combine them and take them where I need to. I'll save the first aid kit. Presumably for the final fight that's coming up soon. Uh, combine. Oh, wait, what? Anywhere thing I can interact with here. Mm, nothing useful here, nothing useful here. Right, man's portrait is played as a large scratch on the canvas. Hmm. Climb down the ladder, yep. Right. Oh wait, I think I've I think I've I think a penny's dropped. There was that big case thing that was like locked.
Let me just pick up this herb. And let's combine. Make a super green herb. And there's another herb here, which I don't think we can combine into that. But I can just use this herb the now to get hopefully get myself out of caution. Right. Where's the door that I'm looking for? Oh fuck, there we go. I think it's in here. Right. And then was it down here, maybe? How's the resi going? I think it's going okay, but me I'm near the I'm right near the end. I'm now also very, very lost. Oh, oh wait, I've got four of these. Yes, man, we did it. We've made the gold dragonfly. A dragonfly object made of jewels and gold. Oh, boys, we've done it. Right, hmm. How you doing, Proto? How's your day going? I think I'm literally on the cusp of finishing this. But first, I'm just gonna make a wee... I'm just gonna make a wee detour. I think there's an item box in there, isn't there? Wait, what one's purple and what one's blue? Blue is the item box. Wait, you know what? I'll save. Ah, shit. My day's been alright. Got an envy tomorrow, so it's been perfect. Oh, nice. Hopefully it goes well. Best of luck for you. But what have you been playing recently, Proto? What's What's been on the agenda? Right, uh... Item box, which is... Down this way, I think. Oh, it's a tentacle. Honestly, I've just been playing a bunch of Picross. What, what is Picross? Because I met, the only time I've even thought about Picross was when I seen the Mario one, where he's like an archaeologist. That's all I know about that that game. Right. Leave the shotgun just don't need them. Acid rounds, sure. Flame rounds, DM instead. Hmm. When did I use the, L the Luger replica? I assume I've missed the chance to use it. Right, I'm going. Look at in the corner, boys. What's that? What's that? Oh, I don't know. Something just, you know. Right. Hmm. Security file. Let's check this. Puzzle game where you're trying to uh, correctly colour in squares based on the numbers on each tile. Pretty fun. Not complicated either. Oh, I got a security card. Would you look at that? Right, so I think I need to head to... Right, so I'm just trying to work out my brain where I need to go. I'm, I'm just going to have a look around this room just in case I've forgot anything. Because every little helps. Right. Where am I going now? I can't believe it didn't just give you a save point right there. I could walk to the save point, which I might actually do. How far away is it? I can't be fucked now. So that's where Claire is and Claire... I must save Claire. And Claire gave me some ammo. It's in there. It's not worth it, is it? 
Right, there's a bunch of boys that are getting up. Emergency evacuation elevator, only working in an emergency. Right. It's locked. There's a hollow in the shape of a dragonfly. Right, so I think we need to use it here, so I'm just gonna... If everyone looks away, boys, for a second... Oh, what's that? Oh, it's a meteor! Would you look at that? I put the fucking... Ah! I put the fucking... Key in the... Storage. Oh my god, I'm a fucking dafty. Legitimately the one thing I need, and that's what I put in storage. Excuse me, Claire, we'll have to wait. Girl Dan needs to make a run back. Luckily, there is literally nothing standing in my way. But still. There was me getting all fucking hyped up and all fucking, you know. Oh, uh, fucking. Oh, wait, 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 I went the wrong way. I have. It's. It's down that way to the right. Oh, yeah, to Chris's right as soon as I come out his door. You know, boys, I've actually got the next game planned after this. I'm, at, I'm not going to say I'm finishing it today. I've got a feeling I might because we're right at the fucking final boss. Because literally I just need to put that, uh, that key in. The gold dragonfly. And then we're fighting the final boss. Actually, you know what I'm going to take? All my items. Because I can't fucking take them with me after the game, you know? So I'm just going to... Right, and what else will I take with me? I can't take the shotgun shells with me because I don't use the shotgun. Gas rounds. Gas rounds probably aren't going to do much. Ah, fuck it, I'll take them anyway. Red herb. If I get poisoned, boysies, I'm fucked. I just need to kill her before the poison sets in and just keep killing up. Bow gun. We've not got any explosive rounds, which... I should have saved them up, but in hindsight, everything looks better, you know? Right, here we go. Here we go, boysies. Last run. I remember ages ago, literally when I first started do doing stuff on my other YouTube channel, I'd done a tier list of all the Resident Evil games. I think I'll revisit it once I finish all of them. Because I'm going to this and then I'm going to do, I'm moving on to side stories now so Resident Evil 4 is still going to be a wee bit off I might just do it after I'm finished with the Crash and uh, Spyro series just have a, a slot that is like this is just Resident Evil games you know right here we go gold dragonfly use you've unlocked the door Oh shit, two zombies. Just. Right, that company's just speed running towards me. Climb up here. There's a terminal. So at least for self destruction. Use the security card? Sure, why not? You put a security card in the slot. Self destruct system, uh, safety, least lock system. Please enter the security code. And it is his granny that he wants to shag. Ron Ka. Uh, is it maybe the title of the game? Have I spelled Veronica right? Right, there we go, there we go. All door locks have been released in order to help expedite the evacuation process. It wouldn't be a Resident Evil game without a self-destruct sequence, with it? It's one of the things you just need to have on there. Oh fuck, there's two of them. Ah, fuck, put me into... Put me into... Uh, 
Sore health. I, I forgot a name for it. Was it caution? Aye, it was caution. You made it. Of course. Come on. Let's get out of here. Oh no! Big tentacle. You know, I never did go back and fight that worm. Ugh. That's fucking bogging. What are we gonna do? With the big anime hair, she does look a bit like one of those like other Sephiroth forms, you know? Okay. Turn the key clockwise simultaneously on three. Got it. Oh, she's mutating even further. Right, there we go, linear launchers open. Oh, and she's raging in our big anime glory. I'll keep her busy. Just go for the emergency elevator. Chris, but I can take care of this. Just go. I'm glad I didn't switch because I have nothing on Claire to actually use against them. I'll do my best. Right, oh, but Claire can't escape. Right, I'm gonna make a wee safe state here. Just in case things go tits up. Oh no! Oh no! Have I fucked it, boysies? Oh no, I had to just shoot her once, never mind. That's it. Final boss over. Game finished. Oh no, now she's mutating. Right, here we go boys, here we go, here we go, this is it. Final battle. And there we go, the cool music started again. And I'm just gonna make a wee save there, just in case. Oh shit, I'm getting pushed towards her. I'll, I'll save my healing up for I start actually limping. Right now, I probably should heal up. Ah, shit. Right, just keep going at her with the grenade rounds. I'm getting fucking ragdolled. Oh, fuck, danger. I'm also out of shots on these, so I'll get the fire rounds in. Shit, shit, this is no good. I've been stun locked. Oh wait, now she's flying. Right, so now I need to... Oh, a bunch of bugs are coming up. It's a bit grotty if you don't like ants. Megan fucking hates ants. I remember one of the grottiest things I've ever seen was the Resident Evil 7 fight with... Is it Margaret? Oh, that's... Right, then just grab a linear launcher. Right, now he's need to run and blast her, I think. She has a very Parasite Eve way of design, isn't she? Right, here we go. Here we go, so now I just need to shoot her once. So I'm gonna make another because she's really hard to hit from what I can remember. 
of what I've uh, heard. So, let's fucking go. Wait. Oh no. Oh no. I'm like a hit away from dying as well. Oh, because I've got my shotgun out, that's why. I've not automatically got the... Well, let's just avoid her mad fire jisms. Fuck. I'm in a bit of a pickle here, boysies. Ah! I shouldn't have saved over my uh, state for the boss fight. That's what I get for cheating. Having to replay everything again, you know? Fuck. And she gets me. So I should cut her once. I'm gonna be here all fucking day, boysies. All day. Shit. Because I keep, I keep expecting it to be inverted the controls, and they're not. I don't know. I don't know why I'm expecting it to be inverted. Oh, I got her! Yes, man! Have we done it? Have we done it, boys? We blew up Alexa uh, was it Alexia Ashford. Cunted her with a big linear launcher. <laughs> Chris, uh... Oh, that was Wesker. Shit. Claire! No! That was no time, Wesker. Wait, have I got a bad ending or something like that? Oh no. Wait, is there a bad ending? Oh no, zombies everywhere. And Chris is just fucking sprinting. If only could have moved that fast during the fucking gameplay. Right, I'm shaking myself, boys. Have I got a bad ending now because I didn't, Chris. like, do something? Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Oh, no! Let her go, Wesker! You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Oh, it's okay. She's safe. It's okay. Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Wait, no. Don't so kill me. Disappoint you. Big anime Wesker is gonna fucking fly through and murder me. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Oh, so Wesker escapes and gets that virus? Ah. And be able to see your. The spoiler. That's what Wesker's doing throughout most of it is just gathering the viruses. I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken you. You get out of here, Claire. Who's Wesker working for? As a surviving member of Stars. I don't think we ever figure that out. But here we go, the fated battle. I don't remember a boss right here. I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who you've killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Just wait, this, this rematch is going to be even hyper next time. Excuse me, my fucking chest is playing up. Just cunt on my pool, yes man. Up, oh, there's Wesker no selling it. Chris, you had guns, use them. 
Why didn't you keep the big linear launcher and just blast Wesker into next week with it? Oh, what do I know? Oh god, have I got another boss fight with Wesker? Oh god. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Wait, hey, what's going on? Claire had the chance to leave, but she's like, I can't leave without Chris. I'm shaking myself, boys. I've got nothing. I've got, like, no health. I'm literally a hit away from dying. And I'm sure Wesker's punches aren't helping that. He's not doing his big Matrix moves yet. He's just kind of punching me. Just wait till 5, it's ridiculous the stuff they do with Wesker. It's so fucking funny. Sure, I'm not human anymore. But just look at the power I've gained. I, I love Wesker so much. He's so silly. But I've chosen to be in my Marvelous Capcom 4 roster, which you can see on my other channel. <laughs> Magnificent, don't you think? Oh, here we go, big anime matrix moves. This cutscene's been going on a wee while, hasn't it? Oh, there we go, we're buried. Wesker under the girders. There's no way he's not kicking out of that. Oh shit, he's kicking out of it. Big super Wesker. Why has he got cat eyes? And welcome to Arkham City, can I explain, try to explain why I wear sunglasses, which I find so funny, like, because when he wakes up, he's like, ah, my, my eyes are sensitive to light, you know? Which is as good an excuse as any, as opposed to, I think they just look cool. Try. Wesker. There we go, big explosion is, uh, kept apart, and it's fucked up Wesker's face. Today's your lucky day. Next time we meet, don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs> I remember actually celebrating when I was playing Resident Evil 5 and he turned up, I was like, yes! <laughs> I love him, he's so silly. He's so over the top. Let's look at him. Surrounded by fire, could escape, but he's too busy evil laughing. I love him so much. Mind has a son. Which they never bring up. Where are you? And his son also has his mad fucking matrix powers. There go, the ants are all burning. There we go. Chris escapes with a big explosion. Hey, you know that I always keep my promises. And there we go. The Redfield twins have escaped again. Not twins, the Redfield, Redfield siblings. Yeah, because he's the older brother. And there we go. Finally, they're together. Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. Oh, he fucks off straight away. But it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. You mean... Proto, I like Resident Evil 6. It's payback time. Yes, man, payback time. Now, let's finish this once and for all. Once and for all. Final battle against Umbrella. How many Resident Evil games are to go? So many. Yeah, I, I will defend 6. There we go. That was Resident Evil Code Veronica X. That's probably out of the Resident Evil games I've played, so... But not counting Operation Raccoon City, because that's a spin-off, but out of 1, 2, well, I played the remake of 1, the original 2, original 3, 
and this. It's probably my, I think it's the weakest of all of them. It's got cool, like, it's not got as many boss fights. It's fucking solid. There's some old bullshit in it. But see, the stuff that's good in this is really good, and I feel this could really be improved with a remake. I think it's some really great gameplay mechanics, but the game they put them in is bad. It's the best, some of the best bro up is the way I can, I can describe it. You know what, like ridiculously awesome action scenes. It's got really good set pieces and really good co op segments. But we'll see how much that holds up when I'm playing the game. But I'm an avid 6 defender. But anyway, I think that was possibly the weakest of the Resident Evil games so far. Still a good game, I'd still give it like a 7 out of 10. It, like, I love Alexia's like cool Parasite Eve plan anime design. The boss fights were kind of cool, what little ones are where. I like the locales, they were kind of interesting, especially I like the Antarctic base and I like going between them when you see the mansion and that was kind of cool. And Alfred was kind of cool, I liked, I liked Alfred's performances. Steve always put a smile on my face. But I feel this could, this really needs a remake. As opposed to, like Resident Evil 4 is still a great game. But I think this has aged a lot worse than the other ones. So this one could benefit the most from a remake, but supposedly it's no getting a remake. Supposedly I think one, I think? said they were. Maybe I forget how long the, uh, long the uh, credits are. So I'm just going to talk about Resident Evil until the credits are finished. So I like overall, it's overall pretty good. I think it's kind of important thing because somehow, you know, Wesker returned, which we will get learn about in Umbrella Chronicles. But, <laughs> excuse me. I need to take a drink because my fucking cough reflex is setting off. Would I recommend Code Veronica? Maybe. If you like Resident Evil, of course. That, that's a silly thing, way to do it. But. Oh, singing the wee song. If you were a diehard Resident Evil fan, I'd say play it. But if you are maybe like more of a casual Resident Evil fan, like, for example, I would not tell Megan to play this because she's played... She loves the remakes. She loves 2. She loves 3. She what loves 4. 4 and 2, she said, are in like, her top 10 favourite games. I don't know if I'd say to her, now, you need to go play Resident Evil Code Veronica, you know? Still, pretty good. The voice Wesker, I'm not but Richard Raw. Again, the voice acting was always really good. Especially Steve. Steve was a highlight. R.I.P. to a real one. Always in our hearts. Gone but not forgotten. The music was really good. I like the Alexia theme. This one that's playing. You know, that was kind of cool in boss fights. That was... Anyway, we're at special thanks, so we should be coming to near the end of the credits. But boys, we're going to take a small break from Resident Evil games. But I promise you, after we beat the next game, we're digging back into Resident Evil games. Slot, right, so I've got two slots. I've always had slot, two slots when I play games. One is going to be Crash and Spyro games for the next while. Slot two was Resident Evil. We're going to dig into something else. And then what I'll do after that, we might just play Resident Evil games. We'll see how it goes. But we will be digging into Resident Evil after the next game that I play. I'm going to put a thing on my Discord about what one I'm going to play next. So, or is it quick? Because I need to I need to go play some side games now. So I'm gonna. But I'm probably thinking between. Let's have a think here. So there's the Gun Survivor games. There's Outbreak. There's Gaiden. Or Gaiden, Gaiden. I'm not quite sure you how you say it. And I think they're the main three spin-offs. So I think we'll go with one of them. I'll just need to figure out how to do Outbreak by myself. Like, I know there's servers for Outbreak, but it's really fucking hard. So surely the AI must be alright enough to actually get through Outbreak, you know? Maybe, please? But we'll see, we'll see how that goes. It probably isn't, you know? But anyway, boysies, Code Veronica, pretty good game. 
when it has high points, they're really high, but when it's got low points, they're really low. <laughs> Probably the most of any Resident Evil game. And that one's got that one's gonna get me some heat when I mention it in the Resident Evil sort of tier list at the end of the the end of uh, when I finish all the games. So there we go. That was Chris and Claire going out on a wee shopping journey. Chris is getting big. You can see him starting to fucking bulk up for five. I think that's why because they thought, oh, I need to fight Wesker now. I got Mars kicked last time. Let's get fucking massive. Ranking E for excellent. Total time just under 10 hours. Number of saves, 39. Number of retries, 16. Not as bad as I thought. Battle game. You're all right, pal. So I, but here at Man Home Video, we always like to be looking to the future. So what have we got coming next in Man Home Video? Let's take a little look. And now, coming soon to video cassette. So boys, I'm kind of cheating with that one because that trailer is for Mother 2, aka Earthbound, which is what we're playing. I have never played Earthbound. It's been on my to-do list for ages. Excuse me. I actually put up on a... Well, my chest is really sorry. Not, but I put up on my... Uh, Discord a wee while ago I was looking to play an RPG again because I like I like playing an RPG in the winter months, you know, when it gets a bit colder, I always play like a long term RPG. And Earthbound was the joint winner for that. And I have never played Earthbound, so I always thought it was one of those ones I was like, oh I need to actually get around to it because I've heard amazing things about it and I really want to play Mother 3. So let's get to Earthbound first. I thought about playing Origins, but Origins might be a bit shite. Well not a bit shite, it's just not aged pretty well and I've heard that you can kinda ignore you know, stuff from um, Mother 1, because you know, obviously it wasn't released here until much, much later. But anyway, boys, we're going to be giving wee Jimmy Shinra a raid. So, let's head over there now. So, slash raid Shinra 7. So, hi, boys. I've been Mikey. You guys have been absolutely fantastic. Hopefully, I'll catch you in my next stream. But until then, boys, have a good day. Have a fantastic rest of your week. Most importantly, boys, have good mental health. Cheers to Red Thong Man, and I'll catch you later. See yous!